So we need to write down the equations which correspond to the given augmented matrices. Uh, so let's start with matrix A. Matrix A, I'll copy paste it here. So in an augmented matrix, each row represents one equation of the system. So here we have two rows. That means that we will have two linear equations in our system. And each column represents a cost in terms of variable. So uh, since we have two columns on the left side of the matrix, that means that we will have two variables. Uh, let's call them x1 and x2. And this, the, the entries of the matrix represent the coefficients in front of these variables. Uh, so we can write it down that this, this matrix represents a system where 3x1 plus 2x2 equals 8. So this equation we get from the first row. And uh, x1 plus 5x2 equals 7. This equation is given by the second row of the matrix. Well, now let's look at matrix B. So here again we have two rows, so we will have two equations, but uh, the number of columns here on the left side of the matrix is 3, so that means that we will have three variables. So we got that 5x1 minus 2x2 plus x3 equals 3. And here 2x1 plus 3x2 minus 4x3 equals 0. Well, now let's move on to matrix C. So in matrix C, there are three rows, so we will have three equations and three columns. So there are three variables. So we get 2x1 plus x2 plus 4 4x3 equals negative 1, 4x1 minus 2x2 plus 3x3 equals 4, 5x1 plus 2x2 plus 6x3 equals negative 1. And finally, matrix D, here we will have 4 equations and 4 variables, so matrix D, we got 4x1 minus 3x2 plus x3 plus 2x4 equals 4. 3x1 plus x2 minus 5x3 plus 6x4 equals 5. x1 plus, plus x2 plus 2x3 plus 4x4 equals 8 and 5x1 plus x2 plus 3x3 minus 2x4 equals 7.